Hello, everyone. This is Father and Son Worlds Apart. I'm Marcus. And I'm Demi. And we're going to talk about Battlefield 2042. And uh, we're going to take a look at the trailer. And we're going to discuss it after the trailer is played. So let's look at the trailer. So that's a look at Battlefield 2042. And looks like a very, very uh, realistic game. Yeah. I mean... That's kind of what Battlefield is known for, for just the mechanics and the realism of the game. is is absolutely insane. That's one of my favorite games to play. I kind of was not a fan of, of the Battlefield 5 and 1, the older war games, but I'm still playing Battlefield 4. A lot of us are still, I mean, it's still hard to get into server sometimes. And that's a game that came out in 2013. So, but they've updated graphics and stuff because I do a lot of, um, yeah, I do still a lot of gaming on it. I mean, it still looks like an up to date, better than some games nowadays, as a matter of fact. And this is, it, is highly anticipated. Is it is it better than Call of Duty? In my yeah, my opinion, absolutely. And I play a lot of Call of Duty. I mean, I play daily Call of Duty Warzone. So, and <clears throat> I'm from once this game comes out, Battlefield twenty forty two, I'm probably not going to play another game for a good couple of years because they've added now so many more features, so many different game modes they found. They've added a battle royale mode, which is what every game pretty much is doing right now, from Apex Legends to, to Fortnite. You know, it's all the, you got a certain amount of people that start, you know, like 100 to a lobby. In Call of Duty Warzone, for instance, it's 150 people play like solo, and, mm -hmm. and it's 150 people that start in a lobby. And you basically, fight your way down to the very last person and you know the last person left wins you know get wins the game and it's ex it's it's hard it's extremely challenging because you're going against 149 other people oh okay wow 
but it is extremely fun and all these are, and i don't know they didn't really say much about that but they did announce that they had a battle royale mode in it which is really exciting because the realism of the game i mean this anybody that's played it knows what you know the do, things do, that when you supposed to come like, out when it supposed to come now, out um, it was supposed to come out october and uh with the beta release already this uh weekend i believe or next weekend um and they yeah they, they yesterday they put out a statement um i can read a little bits and part of it real quick um we've made the decision so this is directly from um oscar gabrielson uh in the battlefield 2042 development team um at dice so they said we made the decision to shift the launch of battlefield 2042 the game will now be released worldwide on november 19th 2021 so oh, okay. which is actually more uh, battlefield usually they release their games around november so this is more like a you know a release date um that's yeah that that's actually what it's been like the whole time so it's nothing new and a lot of people actually responded you know I, I was when they announced this i immediately went on my social media and was like watch there's going to be so many people hating but i was very surprised to see all the love and everything i mean if you go anywhere where they've posted it everywhere it's just nothing but love no please take your time we we love the game we wanted to be perfect just you know, a lot of people would have been pissed because we've, you know, we, we pre-ordered and now the whole thing's been pushed back a month. There's still no really released uh, news. They said they will release news on the beta because um, if you pre-ordered the game, um, then you had access to beta to an early ver a test version of it. Okay. Um, okay. That would have happened, like I said, this weekend or next weekend. Next weekend, I believe, on the 24th, I believe, was, was supposed to be the beta launch. I'm not mistaken, okay. but that's all they said. Now there will be news on the beta launch launch at the end of the month. So I'm just have okay. to wait it out. Okay. So uh, so all the uh, Battlefield 2042 fans out there, how you feel about them pushing the uh, the release date back another month? So let us know in the comments below. And if you are waiting on uh, Battlefield 2042 to come out, and let us know in the comments. And we'll catch you next episode. So, peace.